Comparing angles. In the next example, we're going to take a look at four angles and then compare them, and then choose the correct statement below, A through D. So if I look at these four angles, I first want to put them in order by the largest angle all the way down to the smallest angle. So I'm going to use a 1 for the, longest ang the largest angle and a 4 for the smallest angle. Let's take a look. If I look at these angles, the one that shows the greatest rotation is this angle here in D. This rotation from one side to the other is the largest, so that's the largest angle. In part B, or in angle B, we show the second largest rotation. In A, we show the third largest rotation. And finally in C, we show the smallest, or the fourth largest rotation. Let's take a look at the statements below and figure out which ones are correct. Part A says A is the largest angle. If I look up here at A, we said that A was the third largest angle, so therefore that statement is incorrect. Part B, B is the largest angle. If we take a look at B, we put a 2 next to B, which, set, which showed us that it was the second largest angle, so therefore that statement is incorrect. Part C, C is the smallest angle. If I take a look, we put a 4 next to C, which we used to show that it was the fourth largest or the smallest angle. So C looks like it, might, it, looks like it is going to be correct. I'm going to circle C. And lastly, D. D is the second largest angle. If I take a look at D, we put a 1 next to D to show that it was the largest angle. So that statement is also incorrect. So the only correct statement here is C. C is the smallest angle.